Okay, so hello, I'm Poi Huang, and today I'm going to teach you on uh, the eco in Luis 5. So, um, here's my outline. So, first, I will give an introduction to eco and tell you how to pass the argument, and then talk about what will eco do, and, and later give you some reference about the eco so you could dig in. Um, so, first, I want to give an acknowledgement for Bruce. Thanks him for teaching me eco. Um, so the eco is a user level instruction in RISC-5. Uh, it's used to make a request to a supporting execution environment. So when you go to chapter 2 of user level spec, you can see this in coding format and in this part. Uh, and you can see that eco is actually pretty similar to eBrag. Uh, so after we're talking about the encoding format and based and talking about how to how it's due, uh, we want to talk about how to pass that argument for e call. So, like all the system call, you need to have an argument, right? A Cisco 7, Cisco 8, something like that. So, how do e call get that, get the, get the argument? The system ABI define how parameters for environment requests are passed. So, here's an example about the system ABI. The current Linux implementation uses A0 to A7 to pass argument and use the A, oh, sorry, use the A0 to A6 to pass the argument and use the A7 to pass system call. So here's an example that I got it from uh, Resource Linux on GitHub. You can see uh, it will use the A0, A1, A2, and A7. So after you execute the equal, uh, A7 will be the argument. So here's about how to pass the argument, and so next we're going to talk about what will happen after equal, and the behavior actually depends on privilege level. So you have to go to privilege level spec uh, to find out what will happen. So here's an example uh, about that's a uh, find from spike. Uh, so when you execute an uh, equal, it will uh, see the privilege level. And depending on the pitch level, it was so different um, trap. So you use the equal to supervise the equal. So inside the trap, you have to implement what you have to do. And that part is from the previous spec. Uh, so I hope uh, later when I have a tutorial about previous spec, I will talk more about that part. So, uh, after those, I'll give you some reference, and uh, you can go to those code and go to those uh, discussion to find out more about eco. So this is my introduction about eco today, and thanks for listening. I hope you uh, learned pretty well and have fun at Resfi. Thank you.